Four years ago from the school where I worked at, he was uh, the offspring of some therapy birds we had. And because he has a little bit of a, a bung leg, no one really wanted him, so I took him home. He has been, because I don't like a dog in the house, um, because it's a cattle dog and he's better out in the veranda than inside, to have a bird in the house just gives me someone to talk to. You're really good at mimicking um, all different sound, all different words. Amazing. I haven't had a budgie or known a budgie that can mimic as well and quickly as what he does. He picks up words and phrases. And he can say four words in a sentence, like three or four words, quite big words, like beautiful. That's a big word to say. <laughs> Fondness for the naughty words you found. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Which you know, I, don't, I have no idea where he learnt those from. <laughs> but it just adds to the humour of it because he's quite inappropriate. And when he mixes these words together, he comes out with these sentences. They um, they're quite funny. And you know, being here by myself, just listening to him, it's very entertaining. He's my entertainment. Gosh, I'm a beautiful boy. Hello, birdie. He's four, and I'm not quite sure how long budgies live for, but um, I'll be really sad when he's not here. So for him to have a female and to reproduce and perhaps have some babies, it might be nice that there might be the same gene pool there, and I might get another really good budgie out of that. And then giving them to like a nursing home or somewhere like that where there's elderly people that may be lonely, because I think a budgie is a great companion for a, a, a single person. A lot of people had a lot of advice on, uh, on budgies, but no one's actually come forth with a partner or anything. So I'd be really keen to um, get him a female companion. Females don't, aren't notorious for talking, so she probably wouldn't talk, which um, is quite ironic, really. <laughs> He's um, a really affectionate bird. He's really attached. Hello, beautiful. Yes, hello. It would be lovely to have him, to see him happy with his own little family. Um, hoping that his, his vocab won't change once he gets his own family, that he still can, 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 will continue to talk. But um, yeah, no, it's just, I didn't think he'd get so much joy out of a little bird. <laughs> <laughs>